Hi guys, today's video I'll be trying out the Real Techniques Air Expert Cushion Sponge. This cushion sponge, you're supposed to be able to use it with your favorite cushion compact. So I'm really, really happy. Just because I've been using this cushion compact from Wet n Wild and I really, really like it. The only thing I don't like about this cushion compact is the sponge itself. It's really, really flimsy and using it on my face, it doesn't really do anything for me. It makes the foundations just go on really, really light and sure. And I can't get a buildable co coverage that I like, which is a medium to full coverage, but so I've been using my uh, foundation brush, my Artiste foundation brush with this compact and I've been really liking this foundation itself. So I was really happy to find this and I found this um, at a Walmart in Las Vegas. I know we don't have it here um, where I live. So yeah, let's go ahead and open it up and see what it looks like. So this is what it looks like. Underneath it's velvety. It feels um, pretty similar to the Wet n Wild sponge um, that comes with the compact. Um, there is a difference though. This one is very thick compared to the one that comes in the, in the compact. So let's go ahead and try this out. Now looking on the on the container it says this expert air cushion sponge is designed for buildable airbrush coverage. Gently tap on cushions makeup until blended. Use dry with cushion compact. So you don't wet this you go ahead and use it dry. So let's go ahead and check it out. I'm gonna go ahead and put my hair back. Okay, let's get started. Now, if you notice um, the lighting change, it's just because today I decided to uh, use more natural light than just with my one ring light. Um, normally I have four studio lights plus my ring light, but today I decided to use the natural light and my ring light, but um, it's getting cloudy. So if you notice that the the lighting change is just because of the, um, the clouds covering the sun. So yeah, so let's get started on this. Let's go ahead and tap this on. And the color that I use on this Wet n Wild one is, is the natural beige. So it says to tap it on. Um, right off the bat, it is uh, a firm sponge. It's a lot firmer than this. I, I like the feeling of this one better than the one that comes with the compact. Um, the coverage is a little bit, it's, it gives me a little bit more coverage than the other one. Um, right now it's probably a medium coverage, which I'm liking. The only thing I can say is it, I'm having a hard time getting in here. Usually when I do foundation, I take a brush, a small little um, foundation brush, and I go in between here just so I can get in the grooves. Um, but other than that, I'm liking this sponge a lot more than the one that came with the compact. And I forgot to tell you that I had um, already primed my face. Okay. So, let me see. It does look a little, it does look airbrushed to me. So yeah, I'm really liking this sponge. Um, it's giving me the coverage that I want, which is about a medium to full. Um, right now it's about a medium, but I think if I pat more, it'll uh, I can get it up to a full coverage, but the first pass getting a medium coverage with this sponge is really, really good. I really like the way it looks. Um, it does kind of give it an airbrush kind of look to it. So I'm going to continue using this uh, sponge. And I forgot to say... I forgot to say that um, it was $6.99. So I'll go ahead and put a link down at the bottom where you can get this Real Techniques Expert cushion sponge. Um, it's, re it's really, really good if you like to use cushion foundations. So please don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Till next time. Bye.